YouTube, this is JV111 here, and welcome back to an episode of Agrarian Skies. So last episode, I had to end it up a little bit abruptly because we were running low on time. I did not want to make it a super long episode. No, you guys don't exactly enjoy those too, too much. So, what I did in between last episode and this is, if I can get around, I hooked this whole thing up. It's all ready to go. There's water now being imported into this guy. If we go on to this side, you can see that we're ready to go. Now, you're going to know something very interesting here. There is still an energy buffer here, but there's no real reason for it because all of our power is going to come from here, which is why we're going to need some of the following items. We're going to need some fluid ducts. We're going to need a lot more fluid ducts, so let's go make some. I think we have enough of the, uh, what is it, hardened glass? We'll make some clear ones for this one. If, you know, it wanted to work. There. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Derp. Fluid duck. Let's make a few of you. Let's get a pneumatic. Pneumatic. And let's get a couple. Let's grab a whole bunch. Let's see if you're filling up quite a bit. You are filling up very fast. Does not matter because you will be draining equally as fast very soon. So let's actually grab a couple of Eulorium that we have here. I'll make some more. And we're going to drop it. Eh, where's my reactor port? I'm over here. Put it in. Should be going to town. And we're making a lot of steam. Alright. So. You also notice I have another port into here. There's a reason for that. So. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. you're going to be expelling out steam into here. And very automatically. Did I put you in the wrong port? I did. Eh, no matter. Uh, we're going to set you up to import and we should begin... Yep. The turbines are chart rolling, and we're starting to produce power. It's going to take some time, but now what we're also going to do is the following. So we're going to put him on output. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no. We're going to actually put a cover there for the meantime. So let's get ourselves... Cover. Come back in, yeah. Thank you. Oh nope, let me go down exactly where I wanted to. Can I? All right, give me another one. Excellent. Now, you should end up just auto-exporting water. Exactly what I wanted. I'm going to put another cover here. Right there. And then water 
and water into you. So now any excess water that's created on this thing will get shot back into here, which will help regulate our water situation over here, which we don't really need to worry about too, too much. Uh, we should be making some cyanite as well. Am I exporting you out to the other end, perchance? Nope, nothing yet. So let's go make some more Eulorium. Because we're going to need to fuel that bad boy up quite a bit. This is still making ourselves some power. How much power am, are we making currently? Okay, we need to get our RPM up a little bit higher. There's a butter zone you need to hit. Once we hit that RPM, we'll be very, very good at making all kinds of power. But we're already making quite a bit, and we're going to need to actually start pumping that out. So, do I have any... Oh, I don't have any. Okay, let's make ourselves some redstone energy conduits. So, redstone, I'm going to take you out, come on, do it that way, uh, you're an auto, okay, redstone energy conduit, empty, let's make, I guess that much. All the redstone I have. Don't like being this low on redstone, but soon we won't be. Am I okay on power on you? Mm, could be better, but we're not doing horribly, so that's always good. Made a little more redstone. Excellent. I'm gonna put in eight for now, and we'll go from there. Cause I keep forgetting how much these things take per. You know, I go R. Take two hundred per. So eight gave me four. So another. 16 should I'll go stack speed just for now just to confirm yep another 8 at least should be enough that then the next thing what we're going to do is actually I'm kind of curious wow I'm kind of shocked how much water it's actually taken in so what I'm going to probably do is tweak that a little bit. Nope, nope, no! Don't do that. I don't want you to do that. So, let's tweak that to be moving 20. So, these are going to be moving 20 buckets now. Because I kind of want to empty out my current reservoir. Before I do anything. Alright. Uh, then we're going to lay down our cable. Are we hitting that butter zone yet? Ooh, we're getting close.
We're not over speed, but we're not in our butter zone. So let's start draining some power, see if that helps us out. Okay, let's deactivate. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get another blade. Let's see if that helps. If another blade does not get us up, we're actually going to remove a blade until we hit our optimal range. So let's put a blade there. Now we should be getting enough power into there. Being sure that we get more power over here. So let's see how that's going. And still, it's working faster. That's a good sign. All right, well, in the meantime, let's make some more Yellorium. So, tin. Let's pulverize up a couple stacks of tin ore. And we'll wait and see if there's any other ores that have appeared. It's always a new one that you, you always think you got, but you didn't quite get. Get it. I got the bauxite. That's actually aluminum, so it's another aluminum ore I can use. Nope, looks like everything. And we're getting close to the redstone requirement for the for the hoarding quest, so once we get to that, all the nether redstone is gonna go straight into here and get me a metric duck ton of redstone. Alright. So I'm left for tin. I have a stack. How am I for sulfur? I have a stack. So guess what? Stack Eulorium. Separate into two. Eulorium in one. Eulorium in the other. And because that's actually going to be able to power our system, what I'm also going... Actually, I want to check something. Shoot. How are we doing for you? Holy crap, I am still freaking. Okay, let's use up all the water I have in my system first. So, for now, you're going to be active with signal. And I'm just going to do it to these guys. So now, how is that going to affect this? Ooh, we got higher. We're getting there. We're getting there, guys. Um, what am I currently at? So, I can probably avoid using that overflow. There. How does that affect me? <laughs> Not even. Um, and let's use our fluid ducts. We're actually going to go up on this one, so that, that, and I need to get to here, so there, there,
Thank God these two connect. There we go. And I have water coming in through. Oh. The back. And then I just need power. So you're actually going to go like that. Uh, th stupid thing did it again. No biggie. Oh. Um. Oops. And I crashed. <sighs> so I'll be back. Um. Did not expect that crash. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get it off. there. Back on and see how far we get. And in the meantime, I'm also going to apply power. Plenty of power, and what we're going to do is we're just going to set that back to high. Just out of curiosity, what we'll do is try and make it instead of burping. Not a huge deal because we have a bunch of sunny nights. <laughs> Eject. I'm not taking any chances. Oh, I got the sun in here too. So let's put stack you in there. Let's get some plutonium. I'm going to start the process. And now we have plutonium. 
don't know if the evil of septiconium as fuel source will that does look bad shit so it looks like there's actually no oh wait no there is power difference Indeed, a power difference. It is indeed conium. Didn't look like it at first. So, chef. Oh, you know, wood. Hey, you know what? Here, give me a ten of these. I might need lots of these made today. Let's put in the crap in the back. Make another chef. So it's going to be a bit of a semi-manual operation. You there? Are you? Snore. And snore again, too. There is definitely an increase in using deutonium, which is very, very good. Cyanite bag, which is, you know, it's, it's a definite bonus. How are you doing? How are you faring? Oh, we're hitting that butter zone. If we get to that butter zone, I'll be very happy. I think staff is... Oh, is low? Save hat. Actually, I'll use deutonium. Wait, I could get it if I drop gold there, but... Do a dark path compatible. We're not quite efficient yet. I think we're going to basically probably cap at around one more. So we probably need to put another two more in. So yeah, let's do that right now. Turn that right off. Let's put another blade. Double check on time. Yeah, we're still okay. Alright. So, looks like he's gonna want a little more Eulorium. Am I supporting up the right area? I need to double check that quick, actually. Oh, you're not supporting that at all. Okay. So. Spike seems to be going down now. Interesting. Probably gonna want to look into adding another core. I don't know. But our Eulorium should be finished. Indeed. I also can't wait to get him some Eulorium ore from our system. So that'll help that. We're now working at max capacity. And he's 
very swiftly playing up. Crap ton of power now. I think I might end up doing is probably dropping a bit of speed premium for this guy. I don't know if that will help us or not, but I got a whole lot of heat. But we're also, I need to see how much water we are losing. I think like an upgrade in the fluid thing to be able to put more in here. Or for this guy so he can like pump a crap ton of water into him. I don't have to worry about it. Oh. We're making so much power, we have reserves. That is excellent. full capacity here. I could probably assume that I would need to add another um, two pre-chargers here before I really hit max capacity. So you know what? Let's do that. Actually, let me keep one of the rest of my ingots. Because I need... how many was it? One, two, three, four per, so I need another eight. We hit it, guys. Finally hit it. Now all the redstone, all the nether redstone, belong to us. Let's do that right now. For the hoarding, and our smith. Excellent. So now it's one less thing we have to worry about. So now we can get a whole lot more redstone. Oh, much better now. Okay. So I'm going to need these for now. Um, stone. Sometimes you got to kind of force it. Eight was four. Make one more as a test, and then if that does increase our um, work, then we will. Oops, I think I need to do this in the inventory. Get rid of those. Get rid of the rest of these. Go. 
Slime, Ambient Spoil, I already have one of those. Let's check something now. Everything with the blue thing is good. Excellent. I'll make the next precharger off camera because we're actually starting to run out of time. So I'm just going to drop this bad boy. Right there. There. You're getting power. our work is now increased. So restoration. Get off of this guy. Yes. Ow, ow, ow. Yep, don't stand in the fire. It hurts. Hurt, 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 hurt. Okay. So, I'll make another creature charger off camera. And that's going to be it. So, we now have our turbine going at I hope maximum efficiency oh, right there yes 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 that's exactly where we want it to be um yeah uh wait we could probably add one more I think yeah we could probably add one more so we'll add one more blade um and for the next episode on this we are going to be oh uh, dude we are this thing is rocking and rolling like you wouldn't believe we're gaining an excess of power oh it's a beautiful beautiful sight so guys thank you guys all for watching next episode we will most definitely oh and you're working holy crap um uh, let me double check let me double check before i do anything three two three two works so i'll rig this guy up and he'll be making but yeah guys so that's gonna be it for me next episode i haven't really decided what i want to do um because we have pretty much everything else ready to go going to take some time really to get us to the point where we can start just cranking out all kinds of stuff. So the next episode might be a little bit... I don't know. We'll have to see. Might be more, might be alchemy. We'll do... Yep, we'll do alchemy next episode. So, thank you guys all for watching. If you guys haven't done so yet, please like and favorite this video and any other video you may have seen me in. And also, please subscribe and follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash j the one one one. They're the best way to know when I put out more videos. Also, if you guys haven't done so yet, there is a link in the description down below. Any current YouTubers, any new YouTubers, uh, any YouTubers that want to increase their growth, any one of your friends who happens to be a YouTuber who wants to do any of the following things, any of those past things that I mentioned, send them this link. Send them to these guys, batjuice.com slash j the one one one. They help me out. I want and I want to return the favor. And they're willing to help you guys out too. So, thank you guys all for watching, and until next time, stay frosty.